3 raised to power s plus 9 raised to power s is equal to 27 raised to power s. Hi everyone, welcome to my class. In this class, we want to find the value of x from this given nice equation, 3 raised to power s plus 9 raised to power s is equal to 27 raised to power s. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Solution. We have the given equation. 3 raised to power s plus 9 raised to power s is equal to 27 raised to power x. Then we have 3 raised to power x plus 9 raised to power s minus 27 raised to power s is equal to 0. Then we have 3 raised to power s plus 9 raised to power s is same thing as 3 raised to power 2s minus 27 raised to power s is same thing as 3 raised to power 3x is equal to what? 0. Then remember that if you have a raised to power n raised to power m is same thing as a raised to power m raised to power n which is sort of a raised to power n m. Then we have t raised to power s plus t raised to power s square minus t raised to power x raised to power t is equal to zero. Then from here we say let y is equal to t raised to power x. Then we have y plus y square minus y cube is equal to zero. Let's rearrange this. We have y raised to power three minus y square minus y is equal to zero. Then y is common. Let's factor y out. We have y into y square minus y minus 1 is equal to 0. And from here, we have two cases. y is equal to 0 or then y square minus y minus 1 is equal to 0. Then we've gotten this solution for y to be equal to 0. Then for here, this is a quadratic equation. And let's solve this using quadratic general formula. And in our quadratic general formula, we have S is equal to minus B plus or minus square root of what? B squared minus 4AC over 2A. Then from the given equation, we have Y is equal to what? Minus B plus or minus square root of b squared minus 4ac over 2a. From our equation, y squared minus y minus 1 equal to 0, a is equal to 1, b is equal to minus 1, and c is equal to minus 1. Let's substitute. We have minus into minus 1 plus or minus square root of what? Minus 1 square minus 4 multiplied by 1 multiplied by minus 1 over 2 multiplied by 1. Then we have y is equal to minus times minus. This is 1 plus or minus square root of minus 1 square. That is 1. Minus 4 times 1 times minus 1. This is plus 4. Then over 2. That is 2 times 1. That is 2. We have y is equal to 1 plus or minus square root of what? 4 plus 1. That is 5 over 2. Then we have y is equal to 1 plus square root of 5 over 2 
or y is equal to 1 minus square root of what? 5 over 2. Now, in this case, our answers are we have y equal to 0, then y is equal to 1 plus root 5 over 2, and y is equal to 1 minus root 5 over 2. Now, these are the value of y. Remember that we say 3 raised to the power s is equal to what? y. Then anywhere you see y, you substitute. We have the first case, 3 raised to the power s is equal to 0. This is the first one. Then we have the second case, 3 raised to the power s is equal to what? 1 minus root 5 over 2. And we have the third case, 3 raised to the power s is equal to 1 plus root 5 over 2. Now, we can see that from this one, t raised to the power s is equal to 0. This one has no solution. No solution. Then let's look at this. This is t raised to the power x, and this one is less than 0. Then we conclude that this one has no real solution. No real solution. Now, the only real solution we have is what? T raised to the power x is equal to 1 plus root 5 over 2. This one has real solution. So, let's work with this. This is the only real solution that we have. Then in this case, we are going to work with this. Let's take the log of both sides. That is log t raised to the power s is equal to what? Log 1 plus root 5 over 2. Then we have s log t is equal to log 1 plus root 5 over 2. Now, let's divide both sides by log t. We have s log t over log t is equal to log 1 plus root 5 over 2. Then, this one will cancel this. Then, this is also over log now we have s is equal to log 1 plus root 5 over 2 then over log 3. Therefore, our final answer becomes s is equal to log 1 plus root 5 over 2 base 3. That is our final answer. If you have enjoyed the class, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.